Yes. Hi, hello. Welcome to UG classes. Today we are solving one problem on profit and loss appropriation account. Not only one problem, let us try to solve two problems. One is on guarantee of profit and one is profit and loss appropriation account. Okay, fine. Now, this is the format profit and loss appropriation account, particulars amount, particulars and amount. Okay, already I have given you the format. If you want to check in the description, there is a link over there. You can go, uh, go back and you can check what is the format. Now, directly we are solving the problem here. Okay, now what is the question we'll take? I need two partners. I am taking Ram and Lakshman. They are not brothers here. They are partners here. Okay, we have two partners Ram and Lakshman. Ram and Lakshman. Okay, their investments are 1 lakh and 75,000. Okay, their investments are 1 lakh and 75,000. Here, interest on capital, they are expecting 5%. They are expecting 5%. And interest on drawings, RAM. 2000 and Lakshman 1000. Okay. Next, whatever is pending, uh, Ram, shall we pay commission to the Ram? Ram's commission three thousand. Lakshman receives Lakshman's salary. He receives 500 per month. Check clearly. This is per month, not per annum. Okay. Next, what is the profit? That is the main thing, right? For the whole year, what is the net profit they got? 30,000. Net profit during the year was 30,000. So, this is the a simple question you got. Okay. Can they come in for six more questions for sure? Okay, now let us try to solve. You remember the format, right? According to the format, whatever profit you got, that we will be showing credit side by profit and loss account. What is the amount? 30,000. Next, immediately you should write down interest on capital to interest on capital to interest on capital. Ram, amount is not given directly. He invested 1 lakh. They didn't mention when they invested. So, we treat it. This is used for the whole year. Sometimes for 6 months or 9 months also can come. Along with percentage, you have to calculate even the month's calculation also. Okay, here nothing mentioned. So, I treat it as whole year. Now, 1 lakh on that 5%. How much you will get? It will be 5,000. Okay, next, Lakshman, 75,000. Lakshman, 75,000 on that 5%. How much you will get? 3,750. Next, interest on drawings directly amount is given. If they gives you drawings, 30,000, 40,000, 10,000, something like that, then calculate interest on drawings 10%, 20%, 5% like that. Then you are going to calculate the percentage. Okay. Here they gave you directly what is interest. So you need not to calculate. So by interest on drawings. Many will write this as IOD. Interest on drawings. IOD. Okay. Now here RAM. How much? 2000. Lakshman 1000 and after that Ram is receiving some commission this is called as remuneration to the partners which said you have taken remuneration to the partners it is taken debit side so write down debit side to Ram's commission or Ram's capital account in the brackets commission you can write down how much 3000 next to Lakshman account. Here we are paying the salary. How much? 
500 per month. Per month 500. So convert this to per annum. How much you will get? 6000. If per annum they give, directly you will take. If per month they are giving, you are taking 500 into 12. How many months are there? That sometimes quarter they will give. If it is quarter, into 4. If it is per half yearly they are paying, into 2. Like the different, different they will mention. However, they mention like that you have to calculate. Anything we left? No, right? Sometimes they may give you drawings also. The data is given. It is not compulsory. Everything must be included. To confuse you also, they may give you extra data. So, no need to touch that extra data. Okay? Now, let us see the total. How much you will get the total? And ratio I didn't give. For how much they are sharing? If they don't mention anything, we will take it equally. But here I want to mention something. It is 3 is to 2 ratio. They are going to share their profits and losses. So, now here... First let me check the total. What is the total? It is 33,000. I think credit side is more. Sometimes debit side also more. That means you got the loss. Okay. Now let us see the total of debit. $17,750 minus 33,000. Let us see how much you will get. 33,000 minus... Twenty-five thousand two fifty. Three thousand plus six thousand plus three seven five zero plus five thousand. So seventeen thousand seven fifty. That means this will be fifteen thousand two fifty. Okay. 5,000, 3,750 minus 9,000. You got 15,250. So, this is the profit. So, we are sharing this to the partners. To partners capital account. Who are those partners? This is the total profit you got. So, from this we are sharing between Ram and Lakshman. How you are sharing? In the ratio of 3 is to 2. So, 15,250 into Ram and Lakshman. So, Ram ratio will be, Ram share will be 3, Lakshman share will be 2. Always keep that in your mind. Two names mentioned and uh, ratio also given. What is the first name? The first name, first ratio will be shared to him. The second name will be shared by the second number. Clear? Please keep that in your mind. Don't forget about that. Okay? Now, here 3 is to 2. Now, how do you share? 15,250 into Ram's share 3. What is the total share? 3 plus 2. That is equal to 5. Total share 3 plus 2. That is equal to 5. Now here 15,250 into 3 divided by 5. I got 9,150. So his share is 9,150. Since only 2 are there, you can subtract and you can write down the amount or else you should find out separately 15,250 into 2 by 5. That is 6100. When you do the total, it should be equal. You got 15,250. Or else, how do you do? 15,250 minus 9,150. Again, you will get 6,100. Clear everyone? Once again, I will explain. What is the profit given in the question? 30,000. And after that, what are the capitals of Raman Lakshman is given? Interest on the capital percentage is given. So, we calculate it. Then you got this is the amount. So, interest on the capital always debit side. And after that, what are the remunerations? Commission and salary is given. That is also expense to the business. So, I am writing debit side. So, two Ram's commission account and two Lakshman's account. Lakshman salary account. Okay. Next Interest on drawings. They have withdrawn some money. On that they have paid interest. Okay. They have withdrawn some money. On that they have paid interest. So that is revenue to the business. So I have credited that one. Directly amount is given. I have taken the direct amount. 
after that do the total which side is more please cross check credit side is more so credit side 33000 debit side 17000 250 is there just subtract both of them you will get what is the final profit going to share between the partners if there is no partnership deed they don't mention anything then we will be sharing equally one is to one in the question we mentioned in the last moment i guess it is 3 is to 2 ratio so i have shared between the partners how do i share 15250 into what is the share of ram 3 divided by what is the total amount you have 3 plus 2 5 so 3 by 5 next lakshman's 15250 into lakshman's share is 2 divided by 5 2 by 5 you got 6100 this is how we will be solving the profit and loss appropriation account. okay in this whatever type of question comes more than this adjustments you won't get okay and then next we will solve the problem on guarantee of profit what is guarantee of profit how do you treat it okay and there are two three problems we will do on that because in single method i don't think so we can finish it off okay two two three problems we will be doing then you will understand what is guarantee of profit and in the profit and loss appropriation account how much importance it has taken okay then i hope all of you understood right if you understood please like it share it and subscribe it okay please comment if you are having any queries any more questions you are expecting and any suggestions please feel free and uh, please mention in the chat box okay thank you very much bye bye